the declutter effect. I'm feeling happy and giddy all over because today's topic is one of the things that I'm always interested in and I like doing. We're talking about, drum roll please. <laughs> It's not supposed to be a drum roll. I was expecting you to do something like... <laughs> okay, but you did it with your mouth, so... <laughs> but today, we're talking about project management. And I know that it's not as exciting as I'm making it, but if you're in our industry and you know that you're juggling a lot of things in the air, project management is really something that is super important. It's going to excite you. But specifically, we're exploring the value of project management for small businesses and comparing some of the top players in the game. So it's not just project management as a skill, but project management tools. Our agency takes pride in how it manages clients' workflows and streamlining systems and processes. So it's no surprise that we enjoy using these project management platforms and apps. That's right. Productivity helps you maintain focus on your daily tasks and allow you to do more with less time. We even have a small whiteboard in front of our refrigerator to streamline our meals <laughs> on a weekly basis. So yeah, whenever we can apply the concept of these productivity apps in our lives, we do it with excitement. We do it with excitement. And I love what you said, doing more with less time. And if you're a to-do lister or someone who likes checking things off your list, like me, chances are you enjoy using one or a few of the apps or tools that we'll be mentioning today. Okay, so project management is crucial for business of all sizes. It helps us stay organized, streamline process, and ensure efficient collaboration. For small businesses, it can be a game changer. Providing, game changer, yeah. Yeah, providing structure and clarity to their operations mm -hmm. on a daily basis. Yep. Now, let's talk about specific areas of our business that we can outsource for project management, whether it's handling social media campaigns, website design projects, creating digital courses, or producing our podcast. Project management tools can be our secret weapon for success. So I love the words that we're throwing out. Game changers, secret weapon for success, because it's true. If you don't have one singular system to handle all those mini systems and subsystems, it's gonna blow up and you're gonna have a harder time to manage everything. Okay, so let me correct myself. It's our not so secret weapon for success. <laughs> because everyone, because we're yeah, sharing it now. Doing, Fine. Yeah. yeah, yeah, yeah. Good one. <laughs> okay. These tools automate tasks. They keep everyone on the same page, which is super important. We like it when everybody's onboarded. So keeping it on the same page and provide visibility into project progress because you need to know where you're at. I mean, are you still at the beginning stage? How much are you already progressing in, you know, the project that you're supposed to complete? Now, let's compare and discuss some of the most popular project management tools out there. So if you're in the VA space or not VA, but if you're handling projects for clients, whether you're an agency or you're a small business, you're a coach, you're a professional, you might already be familiar with a few or even all of these. So we're going to talk about Asana, ClickUp, Trello, Monday.com, Notion, and Todoist. So I think the concept of project management app is quite simplistic, but the more you get a ton load of work, on a daily basis. Quite simplistic at first. At first, it gets complicated to the point that you will have a hard time navigating the platform itself. Do you, you can agree? get lost. The more you look into it, the more it will unravel that platform or that system. So you can get lost. So in and of itself, project management tools, you need to orient yourself with it. Yeah, I think that's what's intimidating for some people that you have to manage the project management app because it's too complicated to use. True, true. But right? yeah, we'll try to walk through a couple of them in this episode. We've been hearing a lot of horror stories about it, about clients who are having a hard time just to figure out how a specific project management app works. Okay, okay so let's start with Asana. Asana is known for its robust collaboration features. It excels at fostering team communication, 
assigned task and tracking project timelines. If you're looking for a tool that enhances collaboration, Asana might be the one for you. And Asana is one of the early ones. So if you started your business 10 years ago, then chances are you built your business on Asana. On the other hand, ClickUp is a fantastic choice for agile development teams. It provides powerful features like sprints, custom workflows, which I love, and time tracking. And with ClickUp, you can streamline your software development processes and stay on top of your projects. In fact, Team Declutter is using ClickUp, which fits us perfectly since we're self-organizing and self-managing. That's what you mean by agile development teams. We're self-organizing and we're self-managing. And we are accountable for delivering results that meet the needs and expectations of our clients at Team Declutter. Now, let's explore Trello. Trello's visual interface and Kanban style boards make it incredibly intuitive to use. It's ideal for managing projects with lots of moving parts, allowing you to easily track progress and prioritize tasks. Although nowadays, it's only mostly used for static boards that don't really encourage collaboration. I started out with Trello because I like the ease of using it and it's easy on the ice. But when our need for project management got deeper or more complex, we simply had to switch to ClickUp because the functionalities we were looking for, it wasn't available in Trello anymore. Now, another platform is Monday.com that's worth considering. It offers a wide range of customizable templates and integrates well with other popular tools. So Monday.com is quite versatile. It's a great fit for teams working on diverse projects. Notion, on the other hand, stands out as an all-in-one workspace for content creators. With its flexible layout and rich editing capabilities, Notion is perfect for organizing ideas, creating content calendars, and managing editorial workflows. And it's perfect for one of our clients who are artists themselves. Yes, and actually, content creators really favor Notion a lot because of its interface and it's highly intuitive for what they need, which is content creation. Last but not the least on the list, that's a mouthful, we have Todoist. If you're a fan of simplicity and efficiency, Todoist might be the tool for you. It helps you create and manage task lists with ease, making it perfect for individuals or small teams with straightforward project management needs. So it's very linear. And everything that we talked about, actually, we're going to link in our show notes so that our listeners and people who will visit their website can check and see for themselves and whoever is going to win, you know, the battle of the best management apps. So to recap, ClickUp is the best suited for agile development teams. Asana shines in collaboration, and Notion is a fantastic choice for content creators. Mmm, I love the recap. We have to recap so we can give our own two cents. But each tool has its own strengths and benefits, so it's important to choose the one that aligns with your specific needs and what you can actually take advantage of. That's it for today's episode, Battle for the Best Project Management Tool. We hope you found this discussion helpful in your quest to find the perfect tool for your business. Thanks for hanging out with us for the last 10 minutes. If you haven't already, make sure to subscribe to our podcast so you never miss an episode. This is Team Declutter signing off. Take care, stay curious, and bye for now. Declutter Effect.